The Moor's Account is a historical novel by Leila Lalami that tells the story of the first Muslim in the New World, a Moroccan slave named Mustafa al-Zamori, who accompanied the Spanish explorer Pantalo de Narvaez on an expedition to what is now known as Florida in the early 1500s. The novel is narrated by Mustafa, who writes an account of the journey in an attempt to clear his name after being falsely accused of treason by the Spanish. The novel begins with Mustafa being captured by pirates and sold into slavery in Spain. He is eventually purchased by de Narvaez, who is planning an expedition to the New World. Mustafa joins the expedition as a translator and scribe, and sets off with a group of Spanish soldiers and a handful of other slaves. As they journey through the wilderness of Florida, the group encounters a number of challenges, including hostile Native Americans, dangerous animals, and treacherous weather. Mustafa becomes increasingly disillusioned with the Spanish and their treatment of the indigenous people, and begins to question his own role in the expedition. Despite the hardships, Mustafa manages to form friendships with some of the other members of the group, including a Spanish soldier named Diego and a Native American woman named Hashems. As the journey wears on, Mustafa begins to see the humanity in those around him, and becomes more determined to tell the true story of the expedition. In the end, the expedition ends in disaster, with most of the members dying or being captured by the Native Americans. Mustafa is among the few survivors, and manages to make it back to Spain, where he writes his account of the journey in the hopes of clearing his name. The Moor's account is a captivating and immersive tale of adventure, survival, and the search for truth, set against the backdrop of the early days of European exploration in the New World.